What's up, world? It's your boy TZP back again for another video, you guys. I'm just reading this article that came out yesterday. Just after two weeks, the Army reversed the new policy that would allow people to join the military without having a high school diploma or GED. What is going on? Uh, one of my viewers dropped in a comment. They had waited six hours at MEPS at putting the work only to find out that they were taking back this policy. He was the first person to let me know right now. I'm reading this article online titled, Army swiftly backpedals on policy, dropping high school diploma requirement. Um, this is, in my opinion, this is not a good look. I mean, can't be. I understand that the Army is about 40% short of its goal for this year as far as recruiting. But, you know, making a major significant change in the policy like that and changing it after one week is basically like getting people's hopes up. Um you know, of a shot that they might not have, a, that they don't have a chance in doing and then just closing the door within one week. So uh, I think that's pretty messed up, but I want to try and find a reason here in the article. I briefly looked over it and I didn't find an exact reason, but I'll, I'll read what it says um, in quotations. It says, um, let's see, on June 23rd, the service said that it would drop the requirement for a kind of for completing high school under the condition that enlistees quickly ship out to boot camp, setting a deadline of October 1 to begin training. However, the move was met with some mockery online and accusations of it being a desperate measure, lowering standards to fill in the ranks wherever the army could. Some people have frankly become very self-conscious. Some people have frankly become very self-conscious of the news coverage. An Army official with the direct knowledge of the policy change told Military.com, the service has relatively few options for changes they can implement quickly, so officials have chipped away at the margins where they can. Um, this article, I'll put the link in the description, but they basically do not come out and say why they took it back. They just cover some information like um, uh, if they the people that were going to join, they'd have to score 50 percentile on the ASVAB and so forth. Um and just tells a number of different things the army has done to try to bring in people so they can meet the requirements. They talk about the $50,000 enlistment $50, bonus, but they really don't give an example of why they just pull the rug from underneath a lot of people's feet. I had a lot of feedback on my last video, but man, this is crazy. Uh, in my opinion, it's not a good look. I don't know what's going on, but I hopefully, but hopefully they figure something out. Um, I don't know. Just watch TZP. Quick video. Catch you guys later. Peace.